lets us go through our directories, makes it easy to run applications. In fact, I'll just double click here and bring up the, the clock application. That's not all I've got running here. If I bring these down into iconic form, you'll see there's dozens of tasks already running, many of them demonstrating the advanced features that this NT operating system will have. These include the uh, more powerful graphics, as well as the multitasking capability that includes threads and advanced security. One of the concepts that we feel is important is to support advanced processor architecture. This includes both having multiple processors for symmetric multiprocessing, as well as supporting RISC-type processors. These approaches will allow people to have servers that go way beyond what's available today. And in fact, they'll even bring higher performance down to the desktop. Because we're implementing the same applications interface on our Windows NT product as we will with our Windows on DOS product, we call this a scalable operating system. And Windows is the first product to use this approach. It means that applications can run the same way no matter whether you pick Windows on DOS or Windows NT. Now the key to the Windows NT success will be making it easy to move it into your computing environment. We've done that with applications compatibility, but we've also done it with the way we allow it to work on the network. Windows NT will have available our LAN manager product and it will use the, exactly the same protocols, so it will interoperate with LAN Manager running on top of OS2. In fact, in the computer environment that Microsoft uses, we'll be able, able to bring up Windows NT server by server without ever interrupting our network environment. Ten years ago, we began work with IBM on their first personal computer. In the years that followed, we worked together on hardware and software improvements. For over six years, we worked together to develop OS2 as a replacement for MS-DOS. As it turned out, OS2 had significant limitations. We, we believe that Windows is more appropriate for the desktop and will dominate in that segment of the market. OS2 will continue to have a limited role as a server operating system and for specialized segments of the market. Microsoft is fully licensed to OS2 and will continue to support our customers and license it to OEMs. We are very committed to helping users who have done OS2 development work to migrate to Windows and Windows NT, including providing an OS2 compatibility layer so applications written for OS2 will move over to Windows NT. Our goal at Microsoft is to expand personal computing and help empower individuals with powerful, easy-to-use computers. I call our vision for this environment information at your fingertips. It's a vision for moving PCs to a more user-oriented view, where users think about data and information instead of applications and configuration files. We are already far along in extending and advancing Windows on DOS and Windows NT, both with object-oriented functionality, not only in the user interface, but also in the file system and programming model. Combined with transparent information access, this will be a huge step towards information at your fingertips. Our strategy can be summarized in one word, Windows. We're working hard to improve the base product, and Windows 3.1 out will be out in the near future. We're also far along on the extensions for pens and multimedia, and those will also ship in the near future. During 1992, Windows NT will take Windows into a high-end environment by adding advanced capabilities. Most importantly, all of these extensions will be evolutionary 
they will continue to leverage the investments that you're making in training and applications. Finally, our window strategy is based upon openness in the PC tradition. Hundreds of hardware companies will continue to build state-of-the-art PCs that run both Windows and Windows applications. This means that choice and competitive prices will continue through the next decade as we bring new technology to you. I hope this video has helped to clarify our strategy for the next decade of personal computing. Microsoft is dedicated to making personal computing easier and more productive for you. I think the next 10 years will be even more exciting than the past. Thank you for spending this time with me.